Well, if we took, if we take a look at the at the numbers, um, 2009 was a huge decline in Central Eastern Europe of about, I think, six percent. And if we take a look at last year, um, Central Eastern Europe came out like with plus three percent roughly. So if we take a look at the clear numbers, then it seems like really the the, the worst is behind us. But um, of course, the crisis have left some like some battlefields, if you like, some areas where um, some um, the government or um, specific things need to change in order to to make sure that um, the momentum is, is kept and, and continued in the future. Um, the problem with Slovakia is that uh, it's very heavily dominated by a specific industry like the automotive industry. So the impact on Slovakia was probably higher than maybe in other countries who had more like a more balanced industry and economy. Um, but the good news as well is um, with the automotive like picking up again, then Slovakia will um, benefit from that as well very well, a lot. Mm, now the issues um, that I think still would need to be covered or attacked in the, in the, by the government and um, in, in the current situation would be predominantly um, the, the unemployment, which um, is the result of the crisis where a lot of people lost their jobs. Um, and with seven people, uh, sorry, with one out of seven people out of work, um, it's um, it's it's certainly an area where the government needs to, or certain jobs would need to be created because otherwise there would be some instability going forward as well in that area. Um, as an expectation that unemployment will come down 2013 or even later, uh, so we have to make sure as well that um, the long-term unemployment will not be too too high there. Um, the other thing, of course, is the budget deficit um, with the crisis, um, which is now about 8%, which needs to be as well taken down to a level of below 3%, which is the criteria set by the, by the EU. Um, there's some room in the government itself to do some um, cost savings in terms of increasing the efficiency of the, of the, the budget um, on what it is used for. But also, um, like budget spending needs to be wisely done because if um, you know no money is away, um, available to do further investments in, in government projects, that also will limit then um, you know the, the economy come back as well.